Welcome to Efax Tech. My name is Pradeep and today I will show you how to install Windows 10 on a Mac PC using VMware Fusion. Before we start, please subscribe my channel so you would not miss any important videos and please like share if the tutorial is helpful. So let's start. To install Windows 10 in your Mac, we need two things. One that VMware Fusion installed in your Mac and the other Windows 10 ISO. If you don't know how to install VMware Fusion in your Mac, I have a tutorial for that. See the link in the description. And to download Windows 10 ISO from Microsoft, I have mentioned the link in the description. Please take a look. So launch VMware Fusion. Click on continue. Select use another disk or disk image. This will let you access to the location where you have downloaded Windows 10 ISO, select that file and click on open. Click on continue on this page. This is easy install, so don't uncheck use easy install at the top. Password is optional. Windows product key, we are leaving blank and select the Windows 10 version. I have selected 10 home and tap on continue. As we are not going to use any product key now, so continue without key. This is the page where it says more seamless and more isolated. More seamless, it's something that it will go ahead and get you what you have on your Mac to the Windows side. More isolated, it will give you option that you can select later. On this page, if you click finish, it will start the installation. If you want to customize the setting, click on customize settings. Tap on save. If you want to name anything to the virtual machine, name as you like. Now this page will give you access to the Windows virtual machine settings. Processes and memory will let you change the number of processes and the memory allocated. Hard disk is the default 60 GB. You can definitely increase. The display again is for the video RAM. So we'll close this, click on this triangle. It will start the setup and installation. On that page, click any key from the keyboard. This setup will take time, so I will fast over the video to save your time click on restart now or else it will restart within 10 seconds automatically on this page so it's restarting the virtual machine this all and, and setup and installation of the windows 10 may take like 15 to 20 minutes depending upon your hardware or computer which you have so again I will speed up the video in between these steps. So it's showing the username which has set up using easy install. So it has installed completely. Now it will. This is the Windows 10 desktop. You can click on yes to the network on this pop up. So the Windows 10 has installed successfully if you click on virtual machine at the top and if you see reinstall VMware tools is grayed out so that means it has installed VMware tools automatically now I switched to a full screen and we could see that the full screen is working and VMware tools is the utility which gives you access or manages the full screen so it's working fine in the full screen mode I'll switch back to single window So I'm able to resize the display also. That indicates that I have VMware tools installed. Now I'll show you the copy, paste and the drag and drop between Mac and the Windows. I'm taking a couple of screenshots here. So the first screenshot which I took, I'll show you if I can copy from the Mac side and try to put that in the Windows, whether it works or not. So I copied it. Now I'll do a right click and click on paste in the Windows. And here you go. So this task is successful. So I have taken the another screenshot. I'll try drag and drop from Mac to the Windows side. In fact, you can do this vice versa. This is the good thing about VMware Fusion. So yes, drag and drop is also working. I'll show you what is the Windows version I'm running. For that, press Command and R, R as in Romeo together if you have a Mac keyboard. 
if you have a Windows keyboard, press Windows key and R together. So you will get this run pop-up, type W-I-N-V-E-R. This will show the Windows version. Now, if you want to shut down Windows, you can click on the virtual machine at the top from the menu bar and select shutdown. So this is all about Windows 10 installation on a Mac PC using VMware Fusion. If you think this tutorial is helpful, please subscribe my channel and do not forget to like and share. If you have any suggestions or feedback about my channel or for this video, please feel free to mention in the comment box. Thank you.